For Mashable, I'm Eric Shute. Normally, people who want to be remembered leave something big behind. The pyramids, Machu Picchu, the iPad. But what about the little guy, the everyday person who happened to live 8,000 or so years ago? Where'd they go? Two researchers have come up with a way to track human settlement from epic cities like Babylon to the smallest ancient farms. Get this, using spy satellite photos from the 1960s blended together with modern multispectral images of Earth's surface. This map can track movements like an ancient GPS. In the study, co-author Jason Ur explains, Traditional archaeology goes straight to the biggest features, the palaces or cities, but we tend to ignore the settlements at the other end of the social spectrum. The people who migrated to cities came from somewhere. We have to put these people back on the map. So where are the clues? In those images you saw, scientists are scouring them for anthrosols. They are sort of a digital fingerprint, or soil signature. And in the images, they give off a different appearance to untouched soil which is often the result of high human engagement like building mud brick homes or farming land thousands of years ago. Technically, the scientists aren't the ones looking for archaeological clues. They create a computer algorithm which does it for them. Scientists say you could do this by scanning Google Earth, but the algorithm takes the subjectivity out of the process. While testing the theory in Syria, more than 14,000 ancient settlements were discovered in a 23,000 square kilometer radius. For Mashable, I'm Eric Shute.